What's going on everybody? Coming to you with a quick bass lick lesson. Here we go. All right guys, so let's get to it. Uh, I got so many requests to do some more of these quick lick lessons. Uh, I figured I'd give you guys another one. Uh, so let's see how it goes and let's get started. So this specific lick is from a groove that I played some time ago. I'll go ahead and I'll play the clip for you uh, just so you can see how the groove sound and how the lick sounds inside the groove. Here we go. <laughs> All right, guys, as you saw, that was the lick. I don't know if you can tell, but it literally comes from the Dorian scale. So I'll just call this the Dorian lick. Um, it literally starts off with the Dorian scale, with the first notes of the Dorian scale. All right, so if you don't know that yet, I would suggest that you go take a look at the modes course. There's a huge course on the modes um, that'll tell you every single mode that you need to know. Um, but for uh, right now, I'll show you the quick version of the Dorian scale. So I'm playing in the key in the key of D. I'm playing a D Dorian. It'll be more of like a D Dorian groove because I'm using most of those notes inside of that scale. We got D E F G A B C D. All right. So very quick. Let's go through the lick. So when I started the lick, it was uh, what was it? Right. That was it. Right. I have to like work myself up to it so I can remember exactly what I did. <laughs> yeah, that was it. That was it. Okay. I got my mind right now. Okay, so so let's go over the lick. Really slow. Note by note. So what I meant by starting off on the Dorian scale, I literally started off. Alright, so that was the first. I used the first seven notes, really. I used the first seven notes of the Dorian scale. So, doom. To slow it down a little bit. This is my process for uh, learning licks and learning riffs and stuff like that. So, I take it slow. All right, so let's get that first part. So, after I get finished playing the first seven notes of that scale, I play a triplet. I play a group of three notes, all right? But that's probably what gets you kind of thrown off, all right? But the technique is different. But for right now, just for uh, for learning purposes, let's just pick them out for now. All right, I'll, I'll show you what I mean. All right, so after you get pl finished playing the first seven notes, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now you're gonna play the D, back to the C, B. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six. Blah, 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 blah. All right, so that was the triplet there. One, two, three, four, five, six. So after I finished playing the first seven notes of the Dorian scale, or actually the first six notes, all right, because the triplet starts on the seventh note. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six, triplet. All right, so let's do it again. One, two, three, four, five, six, triplet. So back and forth from the C to the D. Ba, 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 triplet, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, ba, 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 ba. All right, and then back down to the to the B. So one, two, three, four, five, six, ba, 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 ba. Just that much. Try that much with me. Dun, 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 ba, 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 ba. All right, that's the first part of. That's the first. That's actually the the meat of the lick. That's probably the hardest part of the lick. One, two, three, four, five. Whoops, wrong scale. One, two, three, four, five, six, ba, 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 ba. So if you could say that and count that along with me, or if that'll help you as far as the rhythm. One, two, three, four, five, six, triple lip. One, two, three, four, five, six, triple lip B. <laughs> if you can say that. One, two, three, four, five, six, triple lip B. All right. So that's the first part of the, that's the first part of the lick. You got you're almost halfway there. <laughs> so, do, 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 do. All right. So that's the next set of notes. All right. We have uh, A going down, A flat, G. All right, so all together, boom, boom, doom, 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 triple let B. So let's just put just put it together. When you're practicing these licks, just group them together. Just think of them as small licks combined together. 
<laughs> maybe like five or six different licks combined together, right? So just think of it like that. And uh, it, it, it won't become overwhelming if you just break it up and put it into sections. This is how I practice a lot of uh, transcribing a lot of my licks, a lot of the riff that, riffs that I try to do that I hear or that I try to create on my own. I do the same exact process, right? So take advantage of it. One, two, three, four. Whoop, sorry, wrong note. See, I gotta practice too. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, triple it, B. You got it? That much. You got A, A flat, G. Next note. I'm just gonna keep going. You can rewind it if you want to. I don't wanna go over it too many times. All right. After that, after that G, I hit the tonic, I hit that uh the octave, the D, that high D. All right, so let's put add that in there. One, two, three, four, five, six, triple hit B. You're almost home. You're almost there. You're almost there. All right. Just that much. Take your time with it. Take it slow, like I always say. You got one, two, three, four, five, six, triple hit B. All right, starting off with the Dorian scale. Um, I actually didn't finish it. Sorry. One, two, three, four, five, six, triple hit B. If you want to try just that much too, we're just walking down from the A to the G, because that's tough. That's that's a tough that's a tough fingering. I'm, the fingering I'm doing it uh, doing for this is a four three two four. You know that's the move that I like. That if you if you've been following me for any time, uh, any time soon, that's the move that I like to do. All right, that's that's one of the my. Uh, Signature moves, I guess. <laughs> well, it's not signature because I, I stole it from somebody else, I'm sure. But anyway, so let's put it all together. Boom, 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 triple F, B, G, uh, sorry, A, A flat, G, D. From the F to the F sharp, you're going to slide up. Uh, you're going to, it's like a slur for that. You can play it either way, but the way that I played it, I slurred it, you know, put it, put it together. Uh, just slid up to that F sharp. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, triple and B. All right, I hope I'm going slow enough for you. I want to do it one more time, and that's going to be the end of the lick. Slower. All right, and then what I just did, I just ended on the B. Sorry, B. Why, why am I thinking B? I ended on the D. So one more time, slow. And right there, I played with my fourth finger. So it doesn't matter. Either way, whatever you're feeling comfortable with, I play it. Sometimes I went back and forth from playing that D, the, the, the root note with my third or my fourth finger, wherever it felt comfortable for me to actually land. That's where I put my finger at. So that was the lick. Hopefully you guys can implement it inside uh, that groove or any groove that you want to, you know, you want to do. It doesn't, ha it doesn't have to be the exact groove that I was doing. I was just showing you guys a lick. And if you want to actually know the groove and, and uh, let me show you the groove that I was doing, let, let me know below in the comment section. Let me know if you want to actually learn that whole entire groove. I was just showing you the lick, um, but I can uh, if you guys want to hear it. So just let me know. Uh, comment below and let me know um just and also if you like this one if you want to see more of the lick videos let me know too i know i still got a lot more to do <laughs> that people have requested but yeah just let me know which ones you want and i'll be more than happy to give them to you guys um just want you guys to have the actual knowledge of how to create these licks on top of that. And what I'm doing, like I said, I'm starting off with a Dorian scale. That's one of our modes. And that's one of the questions that I get asked a lot is how do I implement these modes into my playing? Well, boom, <laughs> there you go. I'm using a Dorian based lick, uh, literally just playing through the Dorian scale and, uh, adding a few little notes here and there and little chromatic notes and almost like a blues type of scale, um, in a, in a blues way to be able to, to execute that lick the way I want to. All right, guys, so that was the lick. And if you'd like to see more lessons like this, just let me know down in the comment section. I do read you guys' comments and I'll try to take every single one of them into consideration. Uh, just let me know down below. All right, so if you haven't subscribed yet, I'll put a subscription link or button or circle thing, whatever that is. Go ahead and click that and subscribe to this channel. I also put a link up here to the website, DerekBennett.com. You can actually try it all out for free. Uh, check it out, see if you like it. Anyway, like I say all the time, make sure your notes are coming out clean, clear, and precise. And until next time, I'll see you.